most prestigious event, prestigious events here at the Royal Easter Show. show. Carry prize money, total prize money of twelve and a half thousand dollars, and um, six thousand five hundred to the winning pair, and down along the line to eight players to sell us. Not only the money, it's very prestigious, and it's a hard thing to win, a hard, hard event to do, and these guys are all very happy sawyers and fit and ready for a battle. So I think Neil's about ready to call them out. That will start them up to eight, position eight up to one, and then we'll do a little bit about each pair as they come out. Thanks. I need to with this part of the program. So as they do walk out, ladies and gentlemen, we introduce you. We'd love to hear from you and give them a hearty round of applause and say all the best in the event. So down from block number eight, we have out of Queensland, Jack Argent and Mitchell Argent. Could you make them welcome, please, as they give you a big wave? Jack and Mitchell are two brothers, obviously, from Queensland. Uh, Mitchell has won some world championships in the wood chopping event and uh, his younger brother Jack is also a company wood chopper and they're getting right into the story so best of luck boys. On block number seven we will have Daniel Clissold from up around the country music capital of Tamworth and also Christopher Rowan from around South Craft of New South Wales. Both, both of these guys uh, compete regularly together and uh, Keen Sawyers, wood choppers and very competitive in all the disciplines of it in this race today. Block number six, we will have out of Queensland again, James Geiger from around the hinterland of the Gold Coast, Canungra, and also the big fella, Gerald Yules from Kilcoy, Queensland, normally dresses in pink. But uh, give them a big round of applause. Yeah, once again, these two are uh, friendly competitors and uh, compete in a lot of events. Gerald's won some world ch championship wood chopping classes, and James is a young protege, is also on the money. Block number five, we've got again out of the Karoi area of Queensland, Phil Campbell, one of our veterans, and also Shane Raxall from around Queensland, Kenmore area. Make them welcome. These two guys are very accomplished veteran Sawyer's been sorting for a lot of years, had many wins, and uh, very competitive and skillful. We'll be right in this race. On block number four, we do have out of Queensland's Bourbon-Gary region, Jamie Head, and also teaming up this time out of Victoria with Braden Meyer. <laughs> Make them welcome, please. These two guys have also uh, won many, many championships. They're both young uh, competitors compared to the pair before them, and uh, they've won a lot of world championship wood drumming, soaring, and in all disciplines in these timber sports. So, very competitive again. Up on block number three, we've got Blake Marsh and Noel Marsh, both from here, New South Wales. Give them a big wave, big strong lads. So, this is a father and son team. Um, they've both competed well on this before. Noel is the winner of this title in uh, with another partner. And he's out here to get a second one with his son, Blake. They've also placed in this event. Uh, and many other soaring events, so uh, they'll be super competitive. Up on block number two, we've got Leon Critchfield from here in New South Wales and his companion there in the duo, Big Glenn Gillum from down in Victoria. Right. Once again, very powerful beast strong team. Have been soaring a long time together and uh, will be hard to beat. Up on block number one, we've got Robert Dowling from over in South Australia, the big gentleman there against uh, our Tasmanians, his partner, the young green singer, Brad Turner. These two guys are the current title holder and the winners in this event in 2019. No show last year. Very experienced Sawyers. Brad is, uh, makes a lot of these soils. It's his business, the guy in the green shirt from Tasmania. And as does Robbie Dowling, who's a former expat Kiwi, very keen Sawyer, and very accomplished. So may the best pair win. Just before we do start, you've got your microphone. We've got about a minute to go, Philip. Just explain as we had the question asked this. Saying between the Sawyers, the third person there standing adjacent is a job. With a wager, they call it a wager or a sheet in some places. And uh, as the saw goes down, you'll see once it clears the top of the lock, probably by two or three inches, I'll put a wedge in there gently to keep the saw and slab off the, the weight of it off the saw. It makes the saw run better and uh, it helps sawing. If they push it in too hard, it can jam the saw, but 
break off the slab. So it's a bit of a skillful try as well, but I think they're all right to go. And they will start on the mark of three. We'll start. Thank you. Competitors, stand your lungs. Get ready. One, two, three. Yes. Guys, come over this side. Some of you come over this side here, so it's even. Congratulations, Morgan. Make a little bit of noise at the end. Three of the 